McCarran's busiest and biggest airline, Southwest, says it's opposed to the proposed stadium site right across from two of the airport's runways. In a letter obtained by News 3, the airline says, quote, a stadium, whether open or domed, located less than half a mile from the ends of two of McCarran's major runways, will restrict operations at McCarran International Airport and will erode safety, security, and capacity at the airport. The letter was sent to Commission Chair Steve Sisolak, who sits on the Tourism Committee considering how much public money that stadium should get. For Southwest Airlines to come out and say that they're in opposition to that site, and the chief pilot to say that he's in opposition to that site. Uh, the five words, you know, please consider an alternative site are ring pretty solid with me. I mean, I, I have real trouble considering that site or making that site viable. The Raiders have said they'd move here if that stadium gets built. The discussion is how much of the $1.4 billion cost will come from the public. The airport site is just one of several options. Others include the Rock in Rio, the soon to be demolished Riviera, or even Cashman Field. But the airport site was and is the initial pick. Not for Southwest, which says, quote, finally, since most of our customers arrive at the airport via Las Vegas Boulevard to Tropicana Avenue to Paradise Road, we must oppose this site due to vehicle gridlock alone. Southwest also drops a hammer. It mentions its local economic impact. To clog that artery by either restricting runway use or creating roadway gridlock puts all of these benefits at risk. Please consider an alternative site. Sisolak still thinks a stadium will happen, just not here. If we don't take advantage of this opportunity, the problem I've got is when is another opportunity to come along going to present itself?